species of dinosaur discovered in Utah has North Carolina connections. Paleontologists connected with NC State University and the North Carolina Museum of Natural Sciences are now piecing together the story. WRL's Ashley Rowe tells us the dinosaur now has a name. A dinosaur dig in Utah has revealed a previously unknown creature that lived about 100 million years ago. During the time of this discovery, there was very little known about the animals that were around in this particular set of rocks. Lead study author Lindsay Zano, head of paleontology with the North Carolina Museum of Natural Science, helped excavate the bones from the Cedar Mountain Formation in 2014. It led to a new species called the Yanni Smith Eye. It's a cousin of the duck-billed dinosaurs. A lower jawbone helps to tell its story. If you think back to the very beginning of dinosaurs, they all started with triangular teeth, and these teeth have changed to be more oval shaped and to have specializations for eating plants. Bucky Gates with the state's Natural and Cultural Resources says Yanni was much smaller than the long necked dinosaurs. Its femur bone helps to gauge its size. We're going to give just kind of a ballpark range. We're looking somewhere on the order of 15 to 20 feet as an adult would be our guess. Gates says children of all backgrounds who visit the museum are deeply inspired by dinosaurs and Yanni Smithye will surely light their imagination. And so as we pursue our research, we're always thinking about the ways that we can take this information, transfer it to kids, transfer it to teachers to get people more interested in science in general. Bringing in these kids, showing them what is happening in this museum really does inspire them for their future careers. Ashley Rowe, WRAL News. Well, it's fascinating, isn't it? The dinosaur's genus name, Yanni Smith Eye, is a reference to the two-faced Janus, the Roman god of transitions.